Ici Snake. Bonjour, bonsoir tout le monde, comment ça va Alors... Get out of Shell 1. Exactly According to Ames, the president exactly is on the it. first floor of Shell 2's core. Cross the connecting bridge What? from the north side of Strut D to get to Comment Shell 2. That's where you need to go. Attends quoi, qu'est-ce qu'il a dit, pardon <rire> I see a lot of birds over there. The tanker accident two years ago released crude oil containing massive quantities of endocrine disruptors. The fish that absorbed them were then eaten by seagulls, which further concentrated the endocrine disruptors in their bodies. What sort of outcome this will lead to is still currently under review and is yet unclear. It just goes to show that finishing the cleanup of ocean oil spills does not mean that environmental restoration efforts end there as well. <laughs> Alors ce que je fais en fait, j'appuie sur R1 ou R2 pour euh pour euh, écouter les pensées de, du personnage qu'on contrôle. Hmm. Hop. Là, on s'occupe des robots. Ok. Pas de trou. Désolé, mais je vais devoir me, me débarrasser du vêtement. Voilà, c'est au cas où qu'il y ait des mines. Punaise. C'est bon, il est parti. Alors, je dois me rendre euh, sur le shell numéro 2, qui est tout au nord. Ah, et c'est vrai que nous avons des, des level 3. Il me semble que c'est en dessous, là où il y a des niveaux 3 en, en salle. Fouillé, me semble. Ah, c'est celui-là. Ok. C'est le niveau 2. Niveau 3 ici. Qu'est-ce que... RGB6. RGB6, c'est le... C'est le lance-grenade. Ah ouais, ouais. Ok. Why not Je prends. Et prends. Merci. Il s'est effondré. C'est bon. Il est tombé de fatigue. Tout va bien. Normalement, il y en a d'autres qui sont au-dessus. Niveau 3 aussi. Mm -hmm. Des câbles. Beaucoup de câbles. Non. Pas du tout. Et on dirait piège. Piège géant, hop. Nous avons enfin notre petit sniper qui vise directement un peu comme l'autre. Ok. Je voulais être sûr. Alors là, il n'y a pas de. Ah là. Okay. Comme grenade, grenade, grenade. Ah, il y a la PSG 1T qui existe apparemment. Oh, c'est pas vrai. Pire aussi. Ah, 
je vais voir comme un idiot, mais ça ira. Ok. Niveau 3 là-bas. Je crois qu'il y a des niveaux 3 en bas aussi, mais je suis pas très sûr. On va d'abord du coup prendre tout ça. Il n'y a pas eu d'autres. de mon côté s'il vous plaît ce serait sympathique de ne pas venir de mon côté ah non en bas il n'y en a pas enfin si il y en avait mais euh, je les ai déjà fait je crois que du coup je peux y aller Vous casser Si j'ai mis le costume, on est d'accord que. Ah, d'accord, il est toujours démasqué. Ok, j'ai perdu le masque officiellement. Euh, Excusez-moi. Voilà. rien à dire là. Irez-vous Hop. Niveau 3 déjà fait ici, donc du coup on est bon, on peut y aller. Je crois que c'était le seul endroit que je connaisse de tête, en tout cas. Il n'y a pas de... de... de, de salle... Ok, il y a des salles de niveau 3. Allez, on va se diriger vers le chalet 2, du coup. C'est que du niveau 5, il me semble. Si je ne me trompe pas, ou oh, punaise. Loul. Faut que je fasse gaffe parce que celui d'au-dessus, là, il va m'embêter. La tête, voilà. Hop, c'est parfait. Il faut qu'ensuite j'aille au nord. Je sens que de toute façon je suis un garçon. Hop là. Ok. Ah, plusieurs C4. Beaucoup de C4. Right. Can you hear me? Pliskin, where have you been? Checking around. I'm in Strut H right now. How's the situation over there? We have a lead on the president's location. Where is he? Shell 2 core, the first floor. I'm cut off from the core where I am. It's a mess here. All right, I'm on my way to Shell 2 right now. There are IR sensors in place on the connecting bridge between shells 1 and 2. If you break the beams, the Semtex will go off. Yeah, I heard them talking about that. Target the control units and destroy them. Make sure you don't shoot the Semtex. What do the control units look like? Take a look with your binoculars. Hop. Je 
a déjà vu un, mais bon. That's the Semtex. And that must be the control unit. T'aurais pu mieux viser quand même. Hop. Là-bas. Encore les, les, les... les terminaux rouges là-bas. Il y en a derrière la porte, je... enfin derrière le. Le drapeau, je crois. Il y en a sur la caméra, je le vois là. Et arrête de bouger Ah oh, putain d'oiseau Tu sais quoi un petit peu de diazépine pour arrêter de trembler pardon euh quoi peur <rire> c'est drôle hein et eh oh tremblement là il y en a un derrière je crois là derrière le drapeau c'est sûr qu'il y en a un on enfin, tue tous ceux qui sont mieux dans enfin on tue on parle rien hein. Ah putain de tremblement là. Je tire pas sur la caméra du drone, je tire non, sur le putain de truc. Happening. Jack, you have to answer me. Jack, Jack. Ok, en fait, je je tremble ou je fais mal le truc, je sais pas mais. Les épans. J'ai tiré dessus là. Là, c'est bon. Là, t'as pas d'excuses. Hein. objet. Je ne peux pas croire qu'il n'y ait que ça. J'ai vu. C'est bon, il est mort. Et encore les fils. Hmm. 
Ah Petit salaud, va. Bien caché, hein. Voilà. Aucun. Par contre, ça veut pas dire qu'il y, des... y a pas de, pas de mine. Apparemment, non, il n'y a pas de mine. Raiden, j'ai trouvé nous arrivés. Je suis tous ears. L'un des ennemis Kasatkas. Est-ce qu'il est en bonne shape Full tank. Je suis en pour Shell 1 maintenant. Qu'est-ce que c'est ce Harrier Il n'est pas sur le heliport ici. Bien. Je vais mettre ce là-bas. Vous pouvez couvrir les hostages. Ils sont en train d'être tenus au niveau B1 dans le corps. Pliskin. Vous n'avez pas trouvé d'autres endroits où les hostages étaient en train d'être tenus, n'est-ce pas Non, parce qu'ils ont dit qu'il n'y a pas tous les étages. Ok. Combien de hostages y a-t-il Il y a quelques plus courts de 30. Un mort et plusieurs blessés. Le cargo de cargo de l'Ariot va tenir 13 max. Qu'est-ce que les autres cargo J'ai sabotagé. Il ne peut pas venir après nous si il ne peut pas sortir de la terre. Nous allons devoir faire deux trips. Can you fly a cargo I have a pilot who's flown the civilian model, the KA-62 in VR. There's not a whole lot of difference between the military KA-60 and the civilian model. Cleared for takeoff. Raiden, let me introduce you to my partner, Otacon. Ah, Otacon. Hey, Raiden. Nice to meet you. Intruders! Over here! Damn! Right, no doubt. I'll talk to you later. Not a chance. Colonel, I need some answers from you. Who exactly is Pliskin and his partner? I know what you're thinking. It keeps coming back to Shadow Moses. And now this Otacon... <laughs> A.K.A. Hal Emmerich, Ph.D., a Shadow Moses survivor. Rose? Snake and Otacon both became fugitives after Shadow Moses, wanted for acts of terrorism. An anti-Metal Gear organization. They sabotaged and destroyed countless Metal Gear units throughout the world. And were responsible for the incident two years ago that necessitated the construction of the Big Shell. Snake and his partner aren't terrorists. Jack, why are you defending them? I look back on what I've done here so far, and things like training and sense of duty alone won't get you through a sneaking mission like this. Jack, are you okay? You need something higher. I can't think of the right word, but it has to be pure will, backed up by, by courage or ideals or, or something like that. I'd stake my life on it. The solid snake that saved Shadow Moses couldn't turn into a terrorist. Maybe that's true. But they went down with that tanker two years ago. We even recovered Snake's body. And the DNA test results on the body say it's him. Jack, I know what you're saying, but Snake is dead. He can't be here. Not even as this Dr. Hal Emmerich. But that also means that he can't be the terrorist leader behind this thing. Hmm. <laughs> C'est bien que Jack ait des doutes. Enfin, Raiden. I've been waiting for you. A messenger from the Patriots. Where do I know him from? So you're the boss around here? No, not just around here. I'm the boss to surpass Big Boss himself. Solid Snake. No, that is not Solid Snake. Surprise, brother. Save it. You were not mine. Don't say you've forgotten me, Snake. Ouais, c'est lui plus vieux quand même, hein? Snake. Right. Take cover. Impersonating him. 
I'm a whole different game from Liquid. Fais tes alliés, merde. for interfering. Oh, toi, je restais vraiment pas à côté du cimetière. This is the Stinger missile launcher. The Kasaka can't stand up to the Harrier. You have to shoot the Harrier down. Snake, we got company. I'm counting on you. Concentrate. Cool, the Stinger, ça fait longtemps. Ok ok Oh il en reste en plus cool ah, ça, ça picote là quand même hein En plein dedans. Ah, putain, j'ai lâché de vue, du coup, je vois plus. Euh, par contre, on va garder le ration de côté. Euh, merde. Ouh. Bon. Merci de me retirer un missile gratuitement comme ça. Au prix, j'allais dire s'il te plaît, tu peux m'aider parce que tu restes autour. Mais donner quelques gouttes et c'est pas faudrait que tu te bouges de là en fait. Oh, ça fait mal ça, dis donc. Ah, oh, zut. On va y arriver. Ok, 
aqui. Ah, merda. Oh, le petit dodge. Ah, oh, deux fois encore que une cinématique stop mon, mon, ma roquette. Euh, ouais, là par contre, euh, faut que je fasse le Wow, ça picote. Non mais hé, hey, c'est pas juste. Allez, suis-le. Merde. Euh, ouais. Je voulais descendre d'un étage, justement. T'en feu Bah, c'est pas un problème. Voilà. <rire> Petite technique. À connaître. Il ne peut pas exploser ces quatre. Hein. Il est passé où Il est là. Hop. Non, encore une fois. Trois missiles, trois cinécotes. Ok. Euh, euh, dis donc. Disons, tu te calmes. Raté. T'as d'autres munitions ou pas, mon grand Ouais, t'en as là. Hein. Ah, il est là. Ah, non, si je me mets derrière ici, c'est bon. C'est l'autre qui contrôle le... le Metal Gear. Celui qui a été volé par les marines. Enfin, qui a été volé aux marines. Pardon. Oh 
Ça c'est des anti-missiles. Ah non, c'est carrément des missiles, ok. Ce coup encore plus, c'est pas, euh, pas assez stable. l'œil, j'ai une conjonction qui vite. Alors il dit peut-être sur toi, il dit euh, il dit go. Si veut voir les culottes des dames. C'est beau qui court sur How about you guys? Barely managed, but we're all right. The chopper? We need some time for repairs. Oh. The president's all yours. Okay. Can I ask you something? What? Are you the snake? <sighs> They said you were dead. No, not me. There are still too many things I need to do. Snake, you're a legend, and that's why I need to ask you this. Legend? A legend is nothing but fiction. Someone tells it, someone else remembers. Everybody passes it on. I'm here because I was assigned to this mission, not because I want to. If I could, I'd be out of here in a second. How could you come back to all this? Why keep fighting? There's something my best friend said to me once. What? We're not tools of the government or anyone else. Fighting was the only thing I was good at, but at least I always fought for what I believed in. What about, what about the DNA results from that body? That was Liquid's body. He and Snake are identical on the genetic level. Liquid? A deception, for our own protection. We stole his frozen body from some organization. Kind of a hassle, though. That's all there is to it. <sighs> are you two really an NGO? Pour ça que le corps lui manquait un bras. We're a non-profit organization of civilians advocating a cause, yes. The cause happens to be the eradication oui. of Metal Gear. We work on our own, but it's a cause worth fighting for. Why would you stick your neck out for something this risky? That's the way I used to look at it, four years ago. I was holed up in the middle of nowhere in Alaska, drinking too much. We have a responsibility to the coming generations, to the world. What responsibility? To keep track of the mistakes we've made as a species. We need to remember, to spread the word, to fight for change. And that's what keeps me alive. You think you can change the future? Nah, I'm not as arrogant as that. What you do isn't grassroots activism. It's more like terrorism. I admit that. But our group, Philanthropy, received some information. A new Metal Gear prototype was being developed here, and terrorists were planning to raid the facility. The information came from a very reliable source. So you're here to... We're here to stop all that. But I also have a personal motive. Looks like the terrorists have his sister in the big shell. We're here on our own, not under anyone's orders. We have our own battles. Otacon's here for someone. I'm not. This is a military mission. Jack, are you all right? Hey, hey, hey. Just barely. You almost gave me a heart attack. Sorry, it wasn't intentional. I know that, and I know I need to stay stronger. Say a prayer for me, Rose, so I can come back. You will make it back. I'm with you all the way, remember? That means a lot to me, you know. 
I'm going to save the data, okay, Jack? Ok, vas-y, ouais. Ça, ça fait déjà 6 heures que je joue à celui-là. Je me suis pas rendu compte. Metal Gear is already gone active. It's not too late. You can still prevent a nuclear strike by securing the president and preventing password confirmation from taking place. Get to the president. He's in the core section of Shell 2. I'm checking the satellite images. Tuer, hein. Looks like you can get to the core from the other side of Strut L. The core hasn't gone under yet from what we can tell. Follow the railings down, then jump onto the pipes. The only viable strut in the outer perimeter is the L. That attack just now doesn't make any sense. It's like they have no more use for this place. Colonel, you were monitoring the codec calls. That man was the real snake all along. Maybe. Maybe? Don't let your guard down with him. Why do you say that? Because they were never a part of the simulation. They're an unknown factor. You can hey, take yeah, your simulation and... We're out here, we bleed, we die. Calm down. I suggest that you do, Raiden. Even if that is Snake. That has Real. no bearing on your mission. Exactly. You and Snake used to be on the same side. I don't understand. I read about you and Snake in In the Darkness of Shadow Moses. I don't give a damn what that piece of trash said. Do you get me? Et qu'est-ce qu'on y a un peu quand même, hein? Le colonel. A tout caché là. Solo! Allez. Alors, faut que je fasse attention. Hop, là il y a des crottes de pigeons, faut que je fasse attention. Nickel. Ah, je peux avoir des... Pour plus tard peut-être. Pas tout de suite. Hop. Oh oh. Yeah. Hein? This is not a pretty sight. This is not a pretty sight. Oui. 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 Ah ouais, mais non, mais... Ouais, autant en finir, hein. <rire> non, mais il y a les drones et tout, ils donnent l'alerte de suite, j'ai même pas le temps de réagir. Même pas, ils passent par la radio, c'est direct alerte, quoi. Il y a un renfort, la police, la marée et chaussée, tout, 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 tout le monde y est. Et y yeah, yeah. Hop 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 Reste coincé là pour l'instant. On reste caché. Tirez-vous. J'ai l'impression qu'ils vont se tirer. Hein.
Non mais sérieusement J'ai l'impression que je suis obligé de me faire euh, repérer là. C'est quoi ce merdier là J'ai l'impression que c'est une... Toute cette acrobatie pour rien. Je suis bête, écoute. Je vais écouter, je vais pas faire... Euh... Je vais faire ma fine bouche. Je vais les tuer, c'est tout. Je vais essayer de passer par la, par la force silencieuse. On va y aller par la force brute. Hein. Hop. Pas le choix, il faut y aller. Ok. Voilà. Tac. Oh, les, les oiseaux vont s'y mettre, j'ai l'impression. Y'a rien là Non, y'a rien. Fruit L. Pay Matter. Hop. Les genoux bien flexibles. Les cuisses bien costauds. Hop. On va faire comme ça, hein. On va rester euh, strength. On va rester fort. C'est bon, on va passer. Allez. Vous vous en rendez pas compte l'équilibre et euh, la force qu'il faut dans les jambes pour euh, être comme ça. has already entered the nuclear launch code. Secure the president before they can confirm and finalize the code input. The president is on the first floor of Shell 2's core. Attends, je crois que... Voilà. Merde. Uh, uh, right, my sympathies. Sneaking missions are called wet words for a reason after all. Don't worry about it, Jack. It's okay. Rose? That is, as long as you take a shower the second you get back. Do we have a deal? Is this really true? Do you want to take a little bit? Oh, I'm going to have a robot. That's it, I'm full life. Chef, c'est pièce hein Et tout cassé. Voilà. 
Merci. Ok, c'est bon. Oh, ici. Saut comme belette. Hmm Niveau 5, merde. Ouais, avec la piste sur le fond là, il coule encore. Jack, have you remembered what day it is tomorrow? Uh, no. no. I see. I, you said you had something you wanted to talk to me about. What was it? We'll talk about it tomorrow. Why does it have to be tomorrow? So I can build up enough courage first. And so you won't run away. I would never do something like that. Liar. Every time I want to talk about something, you suddenly remember that you have some work you have to do, or you get a stomach ache. Hey, that's not... You know it's true. What are you so afraid of? I'm not afraid of anything, and I won't try to run away. Is that so? Well then, we'll talk tomorrow. Yeah. So, you have to come back, okay? I know. I'm going to have mal au ventre. Hop là. Je savais bien que ça allait marcher. Hop. Ok. Là, on est bon. some unfinished business with him. Olga, calm yourself. Personal feelings. Then screw your plan. I've been... The ocean, right next to my old man. The launch comes first. <clears throat> Where is Ocelot? Not here. I don't trust him. Don't talk that way about one of your own. He's not one of my own. He left my father to die, remember? Olga, oh non, we'll qui talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. All right. I'm headed back there. The upper connecting bridge to Shell 1 is down. What about the chopper? The cam off is out of action. Take the oil fence from Strut L. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Not yet. Their retrieval comes last. The intruder's still at large. Snake. What about the other man? <clears throat> He's got luck on his side, certainly. He survived that explosion. Listen, Olga, the code confirmation is in one hour. Keep the president alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn hmm. the currents on. Of course. High voltage currents on. The door stays shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. And it's no job for bare hands. All right. Come back immediately. One more thing. What? We leave for Russia when this business is done. I want half the money for that. Of course, that was part of the agreement. Mm. We start living for ourselves after this. If there's anyone who wants to stay here, I want you to take good care of them. Gladly. Gerlukovich soldiers are the cream of the crop. It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is dead. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as a reminder, I'm going to say this again, one last time. Don't try anything on us. The feeling is mutual. Hmm. I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't test it. You'll be bacon. Any suggestions? Remember the Shadow Moses VR training. 
take out the circuit panel? Right. But there's no way into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Look for a remote control missile launcher. You can guide it through the duct into the room. Then target the circuit panel. Got it. Right, but make sure you don't hit the president. Mm. The president is wired with nanomachines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that repeatedly, but there's no response. It looks like the walls have a built-in radio shield. So that's mm. why Ames lost contact with him. If you need to that's confirm real. his position, you can log into the node. That's exactly it. Understood. Locate a remote control missile launcher first. Ok, bon, on va en trouver un, bizarrement. Euh, alors. Get Nikita first. Comme bête. Petite mine D au cas où. Jamais ils ont écrit presque quoi, comme ça. Hmm, J'ai du chef ou pas J'ai beaucoup, ouais. Hop. Ok, tiens. On peut enfin prendre le nœud, ce qui va nous servir. Oh bah d'accord. Hmm. Quatre. Ok. Le président est de l'autre côté. Ça vous rappelle pas comme avec le chef du DARPA Yes. Hmm. Hmm. Quelqu'un essaie de me parler en code. J'en suis presque sûr. Ok, alors, je suis sûr qu'on peut faire du morse, mais bon, comme je connais pas de morse. D'ailleurs, ils sont pas très causants. Évidemment, il y en a des nœuds dans celui-là. Je le sais. Ok, c'est parti. Qu'est-ce qu'il y a? Colonel, B1 est complètement flooded, de ce que je peux voir. Vous allez devoir swim through. Je suis fine avec swimming. Stroke the water and move. Je sais déjà. Tellement pas naturel le euh... net vision Google, euh, nickel. Oh shit. Ah mais c'est pas c'est pas Otakon, hein, c'est ça le problème. On respire un coup. Ouch Ça picote Ouf Nikita Ouvé You have the remote controlled missile. Good job. 
Now head for the first floor of the Shell 2 core. Take out the power source and make contact with the president before the launch code can be reconfirmed. Oui. Hurry. Oui. Euh, ouvrir ça ou pas Non. Hop. Ah mais c'est Steelman encore, il y a encore entier. Hein. On va respirer un coup quand même. Hop. Voilà. Encore deux. Hop. Alors, qu'est-ce qui est par ici Il pas grand chose hein, quand même, faut avouer. À part au-dessus ici. Hop, on passe par dessous là. Une garde belette. Et j'ai un thé. C'est quoi le thé C'est pour... Euh... C'est pour le silencieux Pour une plus grande distance Pour une plus grosse frappe Une grosse frappe, frappe comme, les, comme on les aime, c'est ça Hop Lui, il s'est fermé, on est d'accord. Ok, on s'est fermé. Hop. Nous y voici. Ah, mais là, c'est un level 4. Ensuite. Ah, ça sèche un peu. Hop, on y va. Ok, donc ici, il y a un niveau 4. Intéressant, y aller après. Hop. Ok, rien ici. Et donc, du coup, ce truc bleu, c'est pour l'oxygène. Ou que j'en trouve un que je ramasse des suites. Bah, ici c'était là où j'ai eu les lunettes de vision de Google. Les lunettes de vision nocturne. Not vision Google. Je regarde s'il n'y a pas d'autres euh, endroits que j'ai pas que j'ai manqué par hasard ou un truc du genre. Je dirais que non. Ok. Tout se passe bien. Nickel. Hop là. C'est parfait. Hop. C'est dingue de trouver une Nikita juste en dessous quand même. C'est efficacité que j'ai hein. Incroyable. Hop. Il chope là. Nikita Belette. 
J'ai rien en dessous, non. Rien. Alors. Pourquoi Ah, à cause du chef, c'est ça Il y avait une logique. Hop, montons. Il parle là. What is that? Non mais il va pas par là, idiot. Stop it. What is that? Voilà. Le président va bien. President Johnson. Huh? So you're finally here. You've been expecting me? Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military issue. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind of sick joke? I thought you came to kill me. What? I'm prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you... Oh. Hmm. What the... You're a man? Hmm. Well, who are you? Foxhound, sir. Foxhound? I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> Et pourquoi m'avoir touché les couilles? Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes, sir. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Mr. President, it's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear strike. That's correct. I punched the sequence in myself. You're working for them? If you asked me two hours ago, my answer would have been yes. Oh, shame. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are reconfirmed. They betrayed exactly. you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. But you're the president. Did you you have power. No, I'm just a figurehead. What? Huh? I don't have any control. The real power is in the Patriots' hands. The Patriots? The truth behind this country. I'm not surprised you've never heard of them. Very few are aware of their existence, even among those with code word clearance. Huh? Politics. The military, the economy, they control it all. They even choose who becomes president. Putting it simply, the Patriots rule this country. <laughs> no. Hmm. Hard to believe, isn't it? But it's the truth. The space defense, income tax reduction, and national missile defense programs. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. That's what the Patriots want the country to believe. It's all a show. Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. Think about it. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? No. This country is shaped and controlled as the Patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. What you call government is actually a well-staged production aimed at satisfying the public. Huh? Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not your sanity that worries me. The Patriots. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Are they financial, political, or military leaders? No one knows who the Patriots really are. Ah, c'est les francs-maçons d'Américains, quoi. Instructions come from a cutout. All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of twelve men known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? 
merely puppets, pawns in a game. By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator was awarded the presidency. Huh. Of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history, but my ambitions were... You'll understand someday. Hmm. I wished to be a member of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts of terrorism? Yes. I'd intended to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. Bargaining chip? But I underestimated Solidus. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. What are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Picture a massive political vacuum, a space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle, panic, civil war, chaos. Like it or not, the Patriots is an organization that must continue to exist. Mm. So you changed your mind because you wanted to avoid global chaos. Exactly. Quoi. When I told Solidus that I wished to prevent disaster, he replied that pawns can never become players. And who is this Solidus? Celui qui se fait appeler Solid Snake. My predecessor, George Sears. That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid <laughs> nor Liquid. Dit en français. He was a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four years ago? Shadow Moses? That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the development of Metal Gear Rex and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocelot, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Shortly thereafter, Solidus was removed from the presidential office. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his resignation, the Patriots selected me, their new pawn for the presidency. But that would mean that the presidential race was... That was quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to fail him, bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could execute their plot, Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, winning over Colonel Golukovic's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project, an opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued project, he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. Metal Gear is already operational. No, not yet. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray, hijacked two years ago from the Marines by Ocelot. That was not the new Metal Gear. Then where's the new Metal Gear? Right here. What? 
You're standing in it. To be more precise, this entire Big Shell facility is the new Metal Gear. Would you say? No, I'm quite serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an offshore cleanup facility. The main structure extends from the foundation all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Arsenal Gear. That's the code name for the new Metal Gear. Arsenal? That's right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear ray units. Mass-produced? The ray unit was originally designed for the Marines to be used as a countermeasure against the Metal Gear variations throughout the world. The Patriots had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal gear. So now anti-Metal Gears are guarding a Metal Gear. Ironic, isn't it? That's not all. Arsenal gear has full access to the military's tactical network, giving it the ability to exercise absolute control over our nation's armed forces, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. What kind of idiotic weapon? Weapon? No. You're not seeing the full picture. Huh? Arsenal gear is more than just a military tool. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. The Patriots will use it to keep their place as the country's true rulers. Right now, they feel pressured and threatened. By what? They fear an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. Hmm. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when GW is successfully integrated. Once operational, it will be a completely new form of power for the Patriots to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. Masalidus preferred rebellion. Outer Heaven, his plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community, is also a key factor in his offensive effort. Outer Heaven? Listen, there isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating Arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. It won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems and Arsenal gear becomes fully operational. Stop them before that happens. That is your role. Role? You've got to find Emma Emmerich. She's the only one who can stop that thing That's once exactly it's been activated. It. Emma Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal Gear. I believe she's somewhere on level B1 in the core of this building. I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest part of level B1. This is the investor. It'll give you access all the way to Emma's location. Give this to her when you find her. What is it? A program for disrupting the control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2, Shell 1 core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? That's right, modeled after Foxdy. A biological weapon designed to selectively eliminate personnel with a specific genetic code. But why do you have it? The Patriots had it engineered as a failsafe. And Ocelot forgot to search me. You've got to hurry. That disc is the only way you're going to stop Arsenal. Bizarre, hein? De pas être fouillé alors que t'es le président. Well, I've told you everything you need to know. There's only one thing that remains to be done. Huh. Il faut que tu le butes, hein? C'est pas chaud. Kill me. What the? 
There's no time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Cut it out! Mais non, mais c'est vrai, il a raison. That's her role! Abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. Or is it ex-president? The mm. president? Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. Que dommage. I'll see you around, carrier boy. Forget him. He did us a favor. Without free will, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put an end to this charade. Let me at least have the freedom to end it myself. What are you? Hein? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. This is my last order as your commander-in-chief. I'm counting on you. Et pas le choix, la bête, est, la bête était morte et était. Ouais, pas le choix. Et la bête était malade. Fallait la battre. Alors, j'avais deux. The president is dead. I see. I'm sorry to hear that. Where do we go from here? Your mission was to rescue the president and eliminate the terrorist threat. However, given the recent turn of events, we will honor the president's last directive. You must put a stop to Arsenal gear once and for all. Do you actually think there's any truth to his story about this big shell facility being a front for Arsenal gear? I don't have the security clearance necessary to verify the facts. However, he was the president. I'm sure he knew what he was talking about. Aren't you forgetting that he was part of the terrorist plot? All the more reason why I believe his information is reliable. Huh? We're talking about a man who chose to die rather than risk a nuclear holocaust. Thanks to his sacrifice, the nuclear launch authority has shifted to the vice president, effectively eliminating the terrorist threat. Colonel, mm. when you put it like that, it almost sounds like I should have assassinated the president to eliminate the threat. That was not my intention. I was trying to point out that there is certainly some credibility to the words of a man who chose death to protect the innocent. The Colonel has a point, Jack. What about the information he gave me on the Patriots? That's a new one on me. I'll see what I can find out. <sighs> Raiden, we're running out of time. Find Emma. She's supposed to be located on level B1, in the core of that... What's your status, Raiden? Snake, the President, he's been assassinated. What? There was nothing I could do. What about the nuclear strike code sequence? He died before his vital ID could be reconfirmed. Then the enemies lost their nuclear strike capability. But that Ocelot guy obviously killed the president on purpose. Why? It doesn't make any sense. They had to know that they couldn't launch the nuke if they killed the president. Maybe there's a way to launch without reconfirming the vital ID. Or maybe they found a more effective weapon within Arsenal gear. You knew about Arsenal gear? Yeah. Why didn't you tell me about it? You never asked. Am I correct in assuming you also know that the Big Shell's a front for the project? You mean, did I know that the Big Shell, a fully functional environmental cleanup facility, was designed to camouflage Arsenal gear? Yeah, I did. It's exactly what the President and Ames described, a massive cover story. The good news is that it hasn't really done much in terms of cleaning up the environment, so we won't have to worry about any toxic gas being released if we have to blow the house down. Mm. Right. And when did you find out about all of this? It took a while, but we uncovered the info around the time you took out that mad bomber. <sighs> There's no doubt that Arsenal gear is being built here. Then it was all set up two years ago, on that day. All of it. Two years ago? What really happened here? I took these photos two years ago. I know these pictures. They were on the news on several websites. If I remember right, the reporters blamed you for sinking the tanker. That's right. 
Otacon, me, we were used. We'd hoped that by going public with photos of the new Metal Gear, we could persuade the government. At least that was the plan at the time. <laughs> I've gone through the training of the tanker mission before. Yeah, well, I doubt it accurately simulates the events of that mission. I'd infiltrated the dummy tanker to obtain proof that a Metal Gear was under development. Shortly after I made it aboard, an armed group led by Colonel Gerlukovich raided the ship and gained control. Olga and Ocelot were among the raiding party. Yeah, and him. Who are you talking about? A man that was supposed to be dead. Their target was also Metal Gear Ray. But Ocelot eliminated Colonel Gerlukovich and Marine Commander Scott Dolph, and he hijacked Ray. So he betrayed them? I don't know what kind of deal was going down. All I remember is what Ocelot said at the time. Something like, I'm taking it back. Ocelot then sank the tanker, along with the soldiers of the Marine Corps. How did you manage to get out? Otacon managed to have a small boat ready for me. That was the easy part. The tough part was not getting dragged down with a sinking tanker. Small miracle when you think about it. It turned out that the whole thing was a setup to lure us. Photos of Snake, taken by the Cypher, were released to the public. In turn, we became the world's most wanted environmental terrorists. It was definitely a move aimed at putting a stop to our anti-Metal Gear activities. But why did they choose Snake? Since the Shadow Moses incident, Snake became sort of a hero. I think the Patriots weren't too happy about that. You knew about the Patriots? Well, yes, to a certain degree. It seems like everyone knows about them except me. They didn't choose mm. Snake to be a hero, so they decided to do a smear campaign. I think the Patriots wanted to make an example of him so everybody would think twice before opposing them. That's it. They set all this up just to nail you guys. No, there's more to it than that. The Marines Metal Gear Ray project, headed by Commander Dolph, was carried out in opposition to the Navy's Arsenal Gear project. To be more precise, the Patriots considered Metal Gear Ray to be a thorn in their side. Hence, they attacked the dummy tanker and stole Ray. They followed this up with a perfect plan. They immediately sent a fully loaded tanker to the same location and sank it then set up the facility to camouflage the development of Arsenal gear. And we fell for it. Two more puppets in their show. Colonel Gerlukovich and his daughter Olga? Both fell victim to Ocelot's plot. Was Solidus behind all this? He used Ocelot to get hold of Ray, huh? No, he was underground, keeping a low profile at the time. Then it must be the Patriots. If that's the case, what's Ocelot doing alongside Solidus? Hmm. Forget it. We're wasting time. We can figure this out later. The nuclear strike's been prevented, but Arsenal still has a massive payload of missiles to deal with. Right. If the opposition gets control of those missiles... Raiden, you've got to find Emma. Wait a second. Isn't Emma Emmerich... My sister. What's she doing here? You got me. She's a computer whiz who specializes in neural AI and ultra-variable volume data analysis using complex logic. How she got involved in weapons development is beyond me. Hmm. Whatever her reasons, we need her in order to stop Arsenal. Raiden, find her. I'm on my way. <laughs> on my way. Gotcha. Alors, euh, c'était ici que je voulais voir. Avec le Nikita. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ah, et là, ça me refait venir en bas. Ouais, c'est ça. Ok. Je vais visiter tous les conduits. Tous les conduits. Ah. Merde. 
Hop. Désolé, hein, je me suis trompé de chemin. C'est au bout que je dois aller ici. Hop. Oh. Pardon. Je crois que j'ai pris le mur euh, sans le vouloir alors que je voulais prendre le stinger euh, juste avant. Allez, je suis à 17 sur 40 pour le stinger. Hmm. Je suis un idiot, c'est ça Ah oui. Bien évidemment Aïe aïe. Bref. Retournons en B1. Allez, stoppé, ouvre-toi, 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 ouvre-toi. Merci. Welcome to the underground B1. Wow. Allez, c'est parti, on y va direct. Direction de Emma, I, I. Ah merde, putain, je me suis trompé de. Excusez-moi pour les gros mots, n'est-ce pas Hein, quand même. Oh, qu'est-ce qu'il y a? Raiden, are you reading me? This is Arakan. What's your situation? Wet and miserable. This place is flooded. The seawater that's been pumped up is pouring into the building. I see. Listen, there's something I have to tell you about EE. -E. Don't worry about her. I'll get her out. Pas She's ça. afraid of water. What? Yeah. When she was six years old, she almost drowned with my father in our swimming pool. She can't swim? Well, yes and no. We used to swim a lot together when we were kids. In fact, she swam like a fish until that day when she almost drowned. When the accident happened, I was in my room. I learned later that E.E. E. was calling me for help. She didn't doubt for a minute that I'd be there. You could see the pool from my room, but I didn't realize at the time that she needed my help. What were you doing? I... I was... So Emma survived the ordeal. Yeah, but my father didn't. Exactly. So you blamed yourself and left your family. No. E.E. E. seems to believe that was the case. The fact is, I betrayed her. And you think she can't swim because of the traumatic experience? I haven't seen her since that day, but yes, I think so. I got a letter from Julie, her mother, after they moved back to England. In her letter, she mentioned that E.E. E. couldn't swim anymore. But she refused to even wear a bathing suit. Damn! If she still can't swim, we're in trouble. Level B1 in the core is pretty ouais, much flooded. Just le, le Look, porter, tout. Maybe you can help her overcome the trauma. You want me to help her get over it? Well, it's still gonna take some time to repair the cam off. Sorry, kid. Emma's rescue is up to you. <laughs> Thanks. An underwater mission. Well, this is a first. Look, I'll see what I can do. I suggest that you drum the map of the building into your head, because you won't have time to look at it when you try to bring Emma out. I'm counting on you, Raiden. I oh, covered most of the core tête. when I had to take out the C4s. If there's anything you need to ask me, call me on the codec. I'll do that. <coughs> Hop. Voilà, tout va bien. C'était facile, voyez-vous. 
Je vais faire comme son frère et se pisser dessus. Ah. Bien évidemment. Still ticking, huh? Unfortunately, hell had no vacancies. quand même qu'il a refait. She served as well as the live bait for the big catch. Crazy Ivan sometimes speaks the truth. Yvon? Emma's alive? She was some time ago. But the flooding has become quite serious. I wouldn't be surprised if she's a mermaid now. What? Did you really think killing the president would prevent a nuclear strike? Think again! I didn't do it! <laughs> Arsenal is still armed with a purified hydrogen bomb. Purified hydrogen bomb? Hmm? This is no ordinary nuclear bomb. This weapon is capable of heavy hydrogen nuclear fusion using lasers and magnetics to generate heat insulated compression. It was a top secret project initiated by the current president, and Solidus has no idea of its existence. The clean thermonuclear bomb is at an experimental stage and is handled differently. Specifically, it becomes launch capable when Arsenal is activated. A nuclear threat still exists. Six mm -hmm. months ago, we lost everything we believed in. We were abandoned to take the fall in their cover-up. We were labeled as killers responsible for the mass murder of civilians as well as our own allies. And the public believed every word, turning a deaf ear to whatever we had to say to the contrary. Our only goal is to wipe them from the face of the earth and destroy this world of deceit they have created along with them. You're insane. Insane? We might be the only ones telling the truth. Final check for activating Arsenal has been completed. All Arsenal personnel report to your stations. Well, it sounds like Arsenal's ready to go into operation. Damn it! You're still hoping that the girl can install that virus you're carrying around, aren't you? You know? <sighs> it's a shame you're not going to be around long enough to hand her the program. That isn't seawater, you know. It's a byproduct of the microbes contained in the pool. Buoyancy is practically non-existent thanks to the high oxygen content. Once you fall in, you don't come up. Take a good look at your grave. Show me what you've got. Oh, zut, à la fin. Vous m'emmerdez, monsieur. M4 bullet, hein. Bon, dis donc. Fais gaffe à ce que tu veux, toi.
Hop, hop, hop. Hop, hop, hop. C'est 104... Non, 171. Faut que ce soit rentable. Bon, dis donc. Tu sais que tu vas bientôt crever, enfoiré C'est un truc dedans, dis donc. Mmh. Une petite grenade là, ça va peut-être te faire sortir. Ça l'emmerdait. Qu'est-ce qui s'est passé Ah, ça me stun On va y arriver, on va y arriver. Ah, c'est tout tranquillisant, d'accord. Il va y l'avoir là. Ah la tombe de, de cette putain de barrière en forêt. Pourquoi il coule à la Terminator là Colonel, they've apparently completed the final check procedure for Arsenal Gear. Find Emma on the double. You've got to get her to install the virus program that the president gave you. When you find her, take her to the computer room on level B2 in the core of Shell 1. Snake, did you catch all that? I didn't make it on time. Arsenal's going active. Yeah, I heard. The hostage rescue's gonna have to wait. I'm going after Emma. We'll secure the computer room. Looks like we can't install the virus program without Emma. Can't your partner do it? I would if I could. But the security for this system is no joke. I need more time. That's why we need her. Understood. I'll make sure you have your family reunion. Uh, what's up? A lot of years have passed between E.E. E. and me. Then you should see her, right? 
I don't have the right to see her. We can talk about this later. Raiden, I think you'd better get moving. Emma's in the locker room to the north, right? I'm on it. Are you all right? Who are you? Raiden, I'm getting you out of here. Get me out? You're lying. Where are you taking me this time? What are you talking about? I'm here to help. Here, I'll prove it. Do you have nanos? What? Well, do you? I do. Everybody on this project has them. Okay, good. Let's try. Can you hear me now? Nano communication? That's right. I have nano machines too. Then you're not one of them. That's what I've been trying to tell you. And you came to rescue me? Actually, I need your help to stop Arsenal. I understand you're the only one who might be able to do it. And who told you that? The president. Really? I need you to come with me to Shell One. Your brother's waiting for you there. My brother? Come on. We have to get moving. This place will be flooded soon. Swim. You used to love it. How do you know? Your brother told me. He's really here? That's right. He's here to rescue you. I don't believe you. He would never come for me. And I'm telling you he's here, waiting for us at Shell One. No! He left me, my mother, when we needed him the most. When my father died, all he could think about was himself. Emma, we can go over all that later. But first, we have to get out of here. No! I hate water! It's hopeless! I can't swim! I can't swim! 
Jim, you can do it. I can't. Come on, deep down inside, you know you can swim. I can't keep my eyes open in the water. Endless blue. The water, it, it wants me. It won't let me go. All right, then close your eyes. I'll guide you. I, I, I was injected with something. My, my legs. I have trouble moving them. Listen, Emma, just hold your breath. I'll do the rest. First, we'll head to filter chamber two. Then we'll take a break. And all I have to do is hold my breath. That's right. How long? Just a little while. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. That's how I got here. I, I don't think I can do it. I'm not good at holding my breath. Look, Emma, I have an idea. Put your ear against my chest and listen to my heartbeat. Your heartbeat? Count the beats. Don't think about anything else. When you reach 100, open your eyes. By that time, we'll be on the other side. Give me a signal if you think you're running out of breath. What will you do then? I'll swim faster. <laughs> Hang on tight. Okay, let's go. I'm closing my eyes. Take some deep breaths. One, two, three. Wait. What is it? Uh, let me take off my glasses. You know, you should wear contacts. There's nothing wrong with my eyes. Hmm? I wear them for show. Trying to be different sure, from the huh? other girls? No, it's not like that. I like glasses. And there's this guy I liked who used to wear them. Your first boyfriend? No, oh, son frère. somebody more important. Anyway, they bring me luck. I see. Okay, let's go. Ah merde, pardon, excusez-moi, hop. Je juste des trucs vite fait, hop. Ok. Zut, c'est pas celle-là, c'est celle-là. Hop, 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 on se colle bien au fond. Merde. C'est bon, Emma Ok. Oula, oula. Euh, je crois que je suis revenu au début, là, non À chaque fois, j'ai l'impression d'être revenu au début, là. Oui Raiden, go with Emma to strut L. If you exit the Shell 2 core and head south on the KL connecting bridge, you'll get to strut L. There's no time. Move it. Press down and hold the action button near Emma to hold her hand. Start moving with the button pressed down and you can lead her by the hand. Push the action button again to let go. Attendez, hop. Et ça comme ça. Hmm. Attendez. Ah zut. Oui, tiens, voilà, comme ça, je vais mettre ça comme ça. Organise mon autre écran, hein, désolé. J'ai quelques trucs que je peux avoir de sympa. Hop. Bon. C'est bien ça, je me suis trompé de côté. Hop, descend tout en bas. Tac. Voilà. Plus vite, Emma. Faut te dépêcher.
You did good. I concentrated on your heartbeat. It reminded me of when I was a kid. I remember my brother giving me a piggyback ride. I was sleeping with my ear against his back. I could hear his heartbeat. Sounds like you were close. We were, back then. We were stepchildren in our parents' second marriages. Wherever my brother went, I used to tag along. My brother didn't have any close friends, so he used to take care of me. We both wanted to be loved so much. So much that we used to pretend. Pretend? Yeah, we used to play house. My brother was the husband and I was the wife. But it was always just make-believe. We were only kids. You know what I mean. I never had a family, but I think I know what you mean. Comprendre ce. Raiden, what's your status? Colonel? I've got Emma Emmerich here. We've managed to avoid drowning. Good job. Get her over to Shell 1 as soon as you can. That's going to be hard with the connecting bridge on the upper level destroyed. Didn't Olga say something about taking the oil fence at the bottom of Strut L? Yeah, I remember that. You should be able to go down by way of Strut L. Try and get over there. What about Emma? She's been injected with something and she can't walk without any help. Take her with you. Free your hands of any equipment and hold down the action button to give her a hand. To release your grip on her, take your finger off the action button. Emma can sit and wait until you help her back up. And be careful. You won't be able to use any weapons while you're leading her. Now head for Strut L. We're on our way. Raiden, we've infiltrated the computer room. What's your situation? Emma's safe. We're heading your way. <sighs> Good job. Shell 1's deserted. Looks like everybody's aboard Arsenal. I had a look at the system, but there's nothing I can do. EE's our only hope. Right. I'll put her on then. Huh? EE? -E? How? I'll use my Kodak as a relay. Uh, <clears throat> Here she is. Oh, how? Uh, EE, -E, is that you? How? EE. -E. Um. Why are you involved with Metal Gear? Huh? You knew our family's dark history and still got involved? What's wrong with you? I should have known. Answer me. Why are you repeating the same mistake? I... I wanted to hurt you. I wanted to see you suffer. E.E.? -E? You abandoned me. No, that's not what happened. All right. That's enough. <sighs> Who are you? I'm a friend of Otacon's, Emma. Otacon? Enough with the sibling rivalry. That's not what this is. We haven't got time for this. Raiden, get her over here right now. I... I... Gotcha, Snake. I'll head over there with Emma. Most of the enemies aboard Arsenal, but I suggest you be careful. Make sure Emma gets here in one piece. Raiden, take care of my sister. Don't worry. I'll get her there. Alors, attendez. Avant de partir totalement... On va sauvegarder son son codec avant de l'oublier complètement. Hop. Emma, you okay? Yeah, sort of. Hop. Non mais. Non. non, non, non. Bon, maintenant tu vas me suivre. Tu vas arrêter de faire semblant. Ah, c'est le téléphone. De toute façon, cette zone contient des mines clés morts. Ah, oui, effectivement. Il y a encore de l'eau. Emma, 
Snake and Hal are waiting for us in Shell One's computer room. I've got this disk that the President gave me. This disk is supposed to contain a virus that can corrupt Arsenal Gear's operating system. We need you to... This is... this is my program. What? Why did the President give it to you? Huh? Did something happen to the President? Oh, he's dead. President, he's dead. What? You actually wrote this virus? It's not really a virus. It's more like a worm cluster. It's actually a delayed effect autonomous program that's designed to invade GW's cerebrum and render its nerve connections useless. You know what GW is? Of course. I created it. Huh? You look surprised. Uh, well... Cat got your tongue? I'm sorry, I... How about the Patriots? Ever heard of them? Yes, but I only know what I've been told. Can you tell me what you know? Um, sure, but it's hard to put into words. Right. Are you reading me, Emma? Yes, loud and clear. The president said that Arsenal gear was the Patriots' key to supremacy. That's as good a description as any. What exactly is it? It's a massive data processing system capable of controlling information on a global scale. A data processing system? That's right. The system's a social device for maintaining the Patriots' control. You've lost me. Well, in this day and age, information emerges from every direction and is freely distributed. A variety of information gathered by servers employing the latest in high-speed communication networks and P2P technology is rapidly circulated to individuals. In fact, the speed of this circulation process is accelerating on an almost daily basis. The Patriots seem to be afraid of this development. Apparently, they believe that their role will shift from dominant to dominated. Huh? But let me give you an example. You're aware of Solid Snake's anti-Metal Gear activities, aren't you? Yeah, I know a little about it. Well, that's just a small sample of uncontrolled information. I can guarantee you the Patriots did not want Solid Snake's name publicized. Now, look at it like this. Political scandal, corporate corruption, up until now, the Patriots have managed to keep a lid on these and other self-serving events. But with their existing data processing system, they're no longer able to effectively control the flow of information generated at the individual level. With the newly created system, they can fully regulate digital information. High-level information can be categorized in stages, given clearance levels, and deleted as necessary, never to be seen by the public. By deleting such information, the Patriots can shape the course of history as they see fit. Somebody's bound to catch on. No, the memory capacity, not to mention the lifespan of the average individual, is extremely limited. On the other hand, digital information lasts virtually forever. It doesn't deteriorate. So? The alphabet. 26 letters, right? It could have been 30 letters. What if the four deleted letters were controlled by a program? Impossible. It's not. In fact, something similar is already underway. Do you know how many genes exist in an individual? About 30 to 40,000? Right. That's what was announced at the turn of the century. But there's actually 100,000 according to the original theory advanced by the scientific community. Information regarding the remaining 60,000 was suppressed by the Patriots. No. Why? How would you know? Do you know what a gene looks like? Did you count them yourself? There are research organizations. Of course. And their reports have already been subtly what altered. What are you talking They're about? They're even beginning to believe the doctored reports. GW is a system <laughs> that allows the Patriots to decide what will be recorded in tomorrow's oh, yeah. history. So what we're talking about is one huge censorship system for deleting information which might be inconvenient to the Patriots. Exactly. The actual physical core for handling the task, GW, is installed in Arsenal. It's the only system in the world with an optic neural AI that has a parallel processing capacity of 980 trillion hammets. I suppose that being a specialist in neural AI and complex logic played a significant role in your association with the Metal Gear project. That's not the only reason. What do you mean? <sighs> I guess there are plenty of other reasons. Yes, there are. I understand. Do you? So Arsenal Gear was actually designed to protect the GW system, wasn't it? Um, yes. 
It's armed with everything, including nuclear weapons, and is fully equipped with cyber-terrorist countermeasures. Physically and logically, it's the ultimate fortress for housing GW. But is the AI actually capable of controlling everything? No. GW is only the system's core. It's only for deciding what data is stored or deleted. The actual subsystem for executing the task exists within our social structure. What? Do you remember the panic that gripped the computer industry prior to the end of the century? You mean the Y2K problem? That's right. If you recall, our government supplied the world with a countermeasure program, using the internet at full capacity. The program was distributed to every governmental organization, every key facility throughout the world. In addition, the same program was included in an OS application for distribution among the public. Let me guess. The Y2K countermeasure contained a program designed by the Patriots. Yes, and everything supplied from that day onward contains the same program. Impossible. Do you know how a computer operates? Do you really know the basic principles on how data is exchanged? Uh... Nobody's aware of it, but there's a subsystem in place, and it's about to be activated. Is that why Solidus wants to burn out every electrical circuit in Manhattan with a nuclear blast? Probably. But the overall system isn't actually complete. What? It still lacks the necessary factors for judging situations. I heard they were planning a major experiment in the next few days to provide complex data for GW to study. And suddenly all this happens. Emma, it's not your fault. If it wasn't for the terrorists... Yeah, you're right. Well, I think that's about all I know. Right. Uh, thanks. I think we'd better head for the computer room. My bird in the computer room. Is he safe? <laughs> that noisy overgrown parakeet? Excuse me, he's a parrot. And he's my best friend. My only friend. Well, the bird's okay. Good. Did you know that in the old days, miners used to take a canary into the mine shafts to detect toxic gas? That's what he's for? No. I really needed someone to talk to. Right. I think we'd better get moving. We've got a little longer to cover than the last time. I'll give it my best. Whatever you do, don't open your eyes. Why not? A dead body, not a pretty sight. Oh. Once we get past it, it'll be too dark to see anything. What are those sticks in your head? These? They're lacquered chopsticks. They hold your hair in place. Did you know that they're pretty popular in Europe and South America? Can't say that I do. You're not only cute, but smart too. Oh, I'm much more than cute. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go. Attendez, revenons ici vite fait. Il faut que je fasse des tests. C'est important, vous savez. C'est important de faire des tests. Allez Voilà Elle <rire> se retourne, c'est vrai. Ok. Donc dès que j'essaye de toucher son cul, elle, <rire> elle se retourne. pas censé commenter mon corps ou je sais pas quoi. C'est bon, j'arrive. Je rigolais. Hmm. Oh, voilà. 
Allez, tu viens C'est parti. Hmm. Elle a plus, c'est bien ce que je me disais. Elle garde pas tout du jour. Ok. Allez hop, c'est parti. Non, allez. Allez, en dessous là, voilà. Voilà. Euh, ouais. Par ici. Attention à la mine. Ici, on est bon. On va à droite là. Une oration de plus, c'est toujours bon. Hop. Petite respiration. On continue. Gauche et gauche. Et nous y voici. Tada. Oui, ma grande. Oh, des coffres. simple hein. Voilà. Hey, hey. J'ai foutu mon pote. T'es obligé de te rendre mon pote. Alors Martin, comment tu vas C'est bien, t'es très coopératif mon petit Martin. Très très coopératif. Hop hop hop, t'essayes de faire quoi là Petit coquin Pop pop. C'est pas de faire le fou avec moi. Ça ne marchera pas. Fais ah, dodo. Ça te fera du bien. Bon, Emma, tu viens? que tu sois là et que j'élimine tout le monde. Hop, 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 fais pas le fou, toi. Bon allez. On va se secouer un peu parce que je suis sûr qu'il a des choses dans les poches. Gagné. J'avais raison. Euh... 
Zut, t'as dit rien sur moi, c'est embêtant. Ça doit être sur autre part alors du coup. Ah, il parle de l'EPL donc ça doit être autre part. On est sur quoi là Ah mais l'EPL du coup c'est... Ici, ok. Quand on descendra. C'est un petit historique, vous allez voir. Là c'est sympathique. Oh finesse que t'es lente Ah Nikita je suis à fond donc pas besoin d'en avoir plus. Oh mince Neymar I I I I I I I Freeze Oh là mon gros, qu'est-ce que tu faisais là Mon chat qui vient de se reconnecter tout seul. Comment t'as plus rien Des chef grenades, c'est toujours bon à prendre. Alors je crois que lui, je pourrais le réveiller avec ça. Pardon Yo Réveille-toi bordel Elle commençait à parler toute seule là. Non. Bon, allez, on y va. Gamine. de dos Hop. quelque chose par ici ouais des petites munitions on refait le plein de tout ça c'est très bien Et encore le string de stinger ou pas euh... là ouais il y en a encore ah non c'était gmt autant pour moi Allez, on vient ma grande. On se presse. C'est fait, les chefs, ok. Allez, on se dépêche. Heureusement qu'ils ont réparé ça, dis donc.
bien pratique tout ça. Oui. Et tu vas faire quoi Et tu sais faire ou pas Là c'était pour avoir euh, tenté de faire des choses contre moi là. Oh, pour qui lui Tu vas mourir. Eh non, c'était un tranquillisant. <rire> un gros dodo maintenant. Hop là. Ouais, Mormon Cuddle pour l'instant. J'imagine que c'est après. Fais gaffe à pas. Ah, j'avais même pas vu que j'avais l'armure. Pas le gilet par balle. Ah, il est là, le faune. Tu sais, pas au visateur de référer les gens pour éteindre le feu. Oui, je sais. Si je tiens, tiens sa main, que j'appelle Rose. Jack, do you need to save? Ouais. Lui, t'as entendu une mot. Jack. What is it? I've always been alone. Huh? I'm so lonely. Lonely. Rose, we've always... Not always. What do you mean? You've never slept beside me. What are you talking about? I... After we've been together in my room, you stay awake all night, or you head for the door. Is this really the time to bring this up? Why, Jack? Why? Listen, Rose, I'm right in the middle of a mission, and I... Why? Why can't you relax when you're with me? Look, the mission, I... Why don't you open up to me? Rose, I, I just can't. All I ever wanted was to share your dreams, to spend a meaningful evening with you. I just wanted to find you by my side when I woke up. Is that asking too much? It's the night. I'm scared of the night. It's got nothing to do with you. Scared of the night? What's that supposed to mean? I can't relax when I'm with someone. Jack, you wouldn't even let me in your room. I need privacy. I just can't be bothered. Bothered? Wrong word. What I wanted to say was that there are certain things that I have to keep to myself. Do you remember that time I forced my way into your room? We'd known each other for almost a year, and you blew up. It was the first time you ever raised your hand against me. What? <laughs> I was so worried about you. Look, <laughs> I'm sorry. It wasn't your violent nature that scared me. It was your room, your heart. Stop it. There wasn't anything in your room. Only a bed and a small desk. It looked like a prison cell. <sighs> Rose? No television set. No family pictures. Not even a poster. Rose, I only used that room for sleeping. A lifeless room. Almost like your empty heart. That's why I tried to keep you out. I thought I was beginning to understand you, until I saw that room. Would you have been happier if I had a picture of you hanging on the wall? That's not what I was trying to say. Enough, Rose. We'll talk about this later. After the mission. Right. After the mission. I understand. <laughs> le mec violent, quoi. Putain, mais... <laughs> tu sais, c'est pas, ta... pas le fait que tu m'aies frappé qui m'a choqué, quoi. <laughs> Normal. How are you, Emma? Okay, I think. Bon. 
Alors... Allez Au fait, c'est vrai Bon, tu peux te lever Liberty Attention Prêt ou pas prêt, on arrive C'était pour te faire passer fraîche Sur la chaleur, c'est pour ça. C'était pas pour t'embêter, hein, je te jure. Shit, Damn I haven't delivered by 5 What's wrong This door is security level 5. I don't have card 5. Damn Giving up already? Ta-da! What the? Are you impressed? You should have told me you had it. Well, the truth is, I just remembered it myself. Mm. Okay. Hmm. Je connais pas les lieux, attends. C'est mieux ce que je me disais. Comment je fais Eh hey. Reviens ici oh. ah, D'accord Euh, va falloir bouger. Allez, Emma Vite Allez, viens. Allez, c'est parti. On passe par la trappe. Wow Sacré courant d'air. I have a question for you. What is it? How do you feel about heights? I can't say I like heights. The water's higher on my phobia list. Why? Well, we have to go down the ladder. How far down? Just a little bit. Why do I feel like we've had this conversation before? How little is little? Mm, about 130 feet. Hmm. Huh. Think you can do it? 
Would you take no for an answer? How are your legs? Better. The numbness is gone. I can climb down on my own. Okay, follow me. Tidante. If we don't hurry, it'll be the last we see. Enemy soldiers, gun ciphers. I don't think we're going to be able to slip past all that. Looks like mm. you can barely support one person. How much do you weigh, Emma? Are you going to ask me how old I am next? If you go alone, I think you can make it across. This is Raiden. Do you read me? Yeah. What's up? We've made it to the lower part of Strut L. We'll have to cross the water from here. Can Emma walk? Yeah, she's okay. The pontoon bridge doesn't look too sturdy. Emma's going to have to cross it alone. Right. The oil fence. There are ciphers and several guards. Raiden, you're carrying a PSG-1, aren't you? Yeah. It's time to play sniper. Not bad. This spot gives me a good view of the targets. You're going to have to cover Emma until she crosses to Strut E. I'll get there and provide some support of my own. Thanks. Think you can handle it? Yeah, I know the drill. I faced a similar situation in advanced mode level 4 VR training with the PSG-1. VR? I guess it's better than nothing. Make sure you don't hit Emma. Right now, with Arsenal's boarding in progress, security should be at a minimum. That doesn't mean it's going to be easy. Given the situation, they've probably got claymores in place to make up for the security shortage. Make sure you use your thermal goggles. Right. Okay, I'm heading for Strut E. Emma, are you reading me? Loud and clear. I'm gonna clear a path for you from here. How? Sniper fire. You're kidding. Trust me. Mm. What if I fall into the sea? I, I can't swim. You were doing pretty good a few minutes ago. Okay. Think you can do it? Would you take no for an answer? No. 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 All right. Mm. Get going. You'll be fine. Allez, c'est parti. Alors. Quoi? Oh, qui c'est qui? Quoi Raiden, where do you think you're going? Bah, Your job is to safeguard Emma. Give her a safe passage with the PSG-1. Ok, ok, ok. Ah, attendez, c'est quoi des trucs que j'ai Je vais regarder, attendez. Euh... Alors, attendez, je mets les lunettes thermiques vite fait. Et je vais m'occuper ensuite. Hop, on met d'abord un petit peu de pentésime. Alors on s'occupe de tout ça. Les oiseaux, c'est bon. Hop. Voilà. Et... Voilà. How did all this happen? What am I doing here? <laughs> I'm scared. I don't want to do this. I'm scared. Okay. 
Et ils sont là-bas, punaise des salauds. Vous avez pas vu Ah, désolé C'est ma faute, my bad My bad là-dessus Encore Ça va bien, Emma. Everything's okay here. Oh, t'es sérieux. Sniper là-bas. Bon, quand même, hein. Euh... euh, ouais. Il y a un petit peu de baise là, ce que je trouve, je pense, moi. La gorge. Et comment ça Bon. Mais putain Excusez-moi pour les gros mots. Ah bah ben enfin N'oubliez pas que je tire sur la plus petite partie. This is Snake. Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Nice and clear. I've reached my sniping position on strut E. I'll provide support fire from here. Right. Do me a favor and take out whatever I miss. Just call me when you want me to shoot. Pas une seconde. Attendez, il faut que je fasse ça, je crois. Snake, I can't handle this alone. OK, I'll take care of it. I'm going to show you how sniping should be handled. Take a good look. My sniping field will be limited to the area you're watching through your PSG-1 scope. Keep a good lookout on Emma's surroundings, even while I'm shooting, all right? Mm -hmm. Je crois que j'aurais dû le faire, tant pis. Avant. Ah mais c'est lui là Hop 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 Voilà Oula Bon, tout va bien. GG. How 
did all this happen? Ah, les tremblements, c'est horrible. Bon, c'est bon. Il est juste en face de toi lui. Peux-tu tirer dessus s'il te plaît Sur le truc là. là les tremblements c'est horrible. Parfait. Intéressant. Oui, merci. Alors. Hein Ah. Il est encore vivant, ce enfoiré. Bizarre, je... 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 je vise pas autant avec le truc. Ça picote un peu, hein. Voilà. Dans la bouche. Oh, T'as eu quelques belles perdues, mais c'est pas grave, hein. Tu iras bien. C'est que des balles de sniper après tout. Ah oui, elle a été quand même plantée. Ça peut pas être moi, j'ai jamais manqué ma cible. Après, euh, j'ai jamais dit qui était ma cible. Après cette cinématique, les amis, on va se laisser ici. Hein. Raiden, Emma's been stabbed. That bastard! How bad is it? She's conscious, but the bleeding's bad. I'm bringing her over there right now. Raiden. Get that disc over here as soon as possible. I'm afraid her time's running out. I'll be there. Oh le petit cul là. Avec un mood beat de Raiden. Hein? Mm. Il 
いいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいいい et les amis, on va se laisser ici, comme ça, ça nous laissera un petit, petit, tout petit, petit. Hey Jack. Cliffhanger pour la prochaine fois. Sur ce, je vous laisse et je vous dis à la prochaine. Ciao, ciao et au plaisir. Rose, can you hear me? I'm right here. Actually, that's okay. Forget it. Jack, what is it? You wouldn't understand. Try me, Jack. Please. I can't. Not to you. Please, tell me. I can help you. No. There's no way you'd understand. You can tell Snake, but you won't tell me? He's different. Why? I'm in this war, too. With you. No. The war is out here. Not on a live feed to some control room. You want me to pick up a gun and fight? Is that it? Lord, no. You're the one person that I'd do anything to keep out of this place. Then what is it? I'm a... a killer. But... I see men hit. I see them die in agony. And I don't feel a thing for them. Don't think things like that, Jack. I'm a born and bred killer. Nothing like Snake. He fights for something he believes in. So do you. You're doing your duty. No, I'm not. Somewhere deep inside, I'm enjoying this. This game.